All right, so guys, today we are going to be doing an iceberg on the planet Earth. So if you don't know what an iceberg is, um, it's everything to know about a topic, a subject. So I'm, I have done the research hours, countless hours, hours and hours and hours and hours and years of uh, research on planet Earth. I meditated, thought of everything. I mean, this was a 36 plus hour project. Uh, so I'd appreciate a subscribe, a like, a share to your grandmother, a share to your father. Just, okay, anyways, man. Enough with the emotions, man. Let's get into this Planet Earth iceberg. So Planet Earth was founded its original name was Planet Kai, and it was founded by the Anunnaki gods. And they created the human beings and raised them up. And that's where you see evolution. That's where evolution comes in. So interlude, um, there was this stink cootie girl. Oh, well, she has, she's on the planet Earth iceberg too. There's this stink cootie girl, man, I nicknamed her the Sabertooth because her cootie smell like, smell like, uh, the Ice Age. And, <laughs> and, um, so yeah, the human beings, so the Sabertooth tiger said they don't believe in evolution. Well, that's kind of strange because you were the one that evoluted. So basically the gods created the human beings and... They evolved, and that's where you see the Neanderthals. That's where you see the Sussy Bacas. That's where you see Fortnite Glazers. That's where you see Glizzy Gobblers. That's where you see Popular Loners. That's where you see Lone Wolves. Um, that's where you see all that come from. Is the gods created it, and they raised up the human beings. You can see all the skulls and pictures of evolution, and they raised them up. So what happened is all the trees used to be big. All the trees used to be hundreds of feet tall and everything. All of us were big. There were giants here. We all lived in harmony. There were communities. It was all community based. There was no money. There was no exchanged goods. You have to understand that money is just a frequency. So everything is just a frequency. Everything is just a energy. You have to actually understand that. Let it download. So basically money it was never money it was just exchange based systems there was communities living together no doors it was all that and then in came so you know how they told you that it was christopher columbus it was not it he came over the ship that ship was a spaceship that ship was a spaceship and they came and they invaded our planet and you want to know why human beings are so good at manipulating aren't they aren't they so good at hum manipulating every last one of them every last one of them you can think of they all are manipulators unless you're a soul so mind you mind you we're gonna get into depths on how this mind this mind control stuff is not just the human beings now it's not just the human beings now ever it it's there's no racism racism is a joke the stuff that I'm speaking that could be called racism is not racism. Race. So let's go back. Christopher Columbus, they invaded. Now, we taught them everything we knew. We taught them the spiritual laws. We taught them all that stuff. And they are so good at manipulating. Listen, so these people that came here, they're the Draconian Reptilians and the Pleiadians. And they, they, grouped, up, they grouped up the human beings. And they learned our spiritual law. And they had us like this, hands tied behind our back. And knocked us out. Took us into slavery. They, they, they wiped us out. They, they killed black people. They killed gods. They killed all the gods and goddesses. They took our land. They built our land over top of, over top of I guarantee you, under your land is dead gods and goddesses. There's proof of this. There's apartment comp, especially in Brooklyn, where it began. There's tons and tons of, they dug, they found, oh, these apartment. They are, what they're doing is they're harvesting spiritual energy. 
to keep us down at a low frequency. And I am proof, I am proof for this. So, so I snapped out of it so quickly because this town that I'm, that I was in, I'm not in the town anymore. I'm on a new planet. I'm on a new planet. The town I was in, it held me down frequency wise. Look what I'm doing on YouTube right now. I spent all this time on one LeBron James iceberg and I had the wrong spiritual energy. Now I'm dropping 10 ice. I'm like now. Okay. Forget what I'm doing. I don't want to make this. This is the planet earth iceberg, but I will be living proof for some of this stuff. I'm saying I am living proof. I am as the most powerful being you say. So they came, they came, they took our land. They imprisoned us. Now, what about the rest of Earth? So Earth was founded by me. I founded Earth back in before the before the years were named. And and I was the I was the leader of the galaxy. I was leader of this galaxy. I created all the realms. I created everything. I did the Big Bang. <laughs> I'm so serious, bro. I did the Big Bang. I made this. I made all this up. I made everything. And I made the dinosaurs. I, I Now, the the asteroid that came, I'm not, I'm not so sure we should speak on that. But I am owner of everything. I come from a different planet. I know this because I took mushrooms once. No, I didn't. And and right then and there, I realized. So first of all, whenever I was on, whenever I, whenever I drank this, um, I I never did mushrooms. I just uh, ate a cookie. And whenever I ate this cookie, I began speaking to aliens. I was speaking to aliens on another planet. They were communicating with me. They were communicating with me through frequencies. They accessed my, my body and I was making noises that I've never made before, that I, that I could not replicate now. I was, I was doing things with my vocal system and human body that I had never done before. And I realized then that I, I am the creator of everything. I am the universe because I was being told that every single move I do decides the fate of the universe. So this is huge on the big, on the planet Earth iceberg because I am, I am the, I am the main, like I'm a huge factor in this, you know what I'm saying? So this is a huge thing on the planet Earth iceberg. So how did we get to where we are now? So there is a thing called light code lockdown, which everyone is in. And I almost fell into it right then and there. You can like, it's, it's such a powerful thing, man. You break through it through affirmations and through, listen, I know everybody knows everything. Okay. Everyone knows everything. Everyone knows what they're doing. Everyone knows what they're doing to d deep down to the core intent no one anyone anyone who says that they didn't know that they were doing this or they they're lying everyone knows what they did everything you picked up on is true i want you to know that hold on a second and how did we get to this through this light code lockdown? Well, once they captured us, once they did all that, they learned our spiritual law. You guys should listen to Jay-Z's music. You know what he said in his music? He said, we go hit a billy first. I told my wife the spiritual it really work. Jay-Z knows. You ever see photos of Jay-Z back way before Jay-Z was supposed to be alive? That's Jay-Z. 
That's Hova. I'm saying I get I get deep everything I tell you in this video is true you just might not be at the frequency to attain it this is why people this is why I am so separated from everyone because I see through everything I see everything literally everything I pick up on energy cycles that aren't that aren't even near me. You know why? Because I am the universe. I am alone. Everything is just me.